And we're learning new details tonight about a deadly car crash in Hamden. Police say a 15 year old sitting in the front seat was killed when the car he was in hit another car. It happened this morning on Dixwell Avenue. And tonight we're getting a look at video from a local business that shows what happened. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Susan Rapp is live with the mobile newsroom. Where the Denise, we are live here on Dixwell Avenue, right where this accident happened. This is a very busy road, and in fact, it happened right in front of a local business. Business. Now, this video that this business was able to capture could be very helpful in this case because it could show police exactly what happened and what caused this crash. And it's just sad. I mean, the way it was just hit, the car itself, when it was just hit, is a uh, all Cameras outside this local smoke shop are pointed right at Dixwell Avenue, and that's where two cars crashed into one another. Arslan Yona shows us the video. A Volkswagen going south tries to pass two cars, but ends up on the wrong side of the road. As soon as the Volkswagen crosses the yellow line, it hits a Honda. Police say a 15-year-old boy who was sitting in the front seat of the Volkswagen died at the hospital. The driver a 27-year-old man was seriously hurt, and so was the driver of the Honda, a 31-year-old man from Hamden. The 15-year-old was seated in the front passenger seat. Uh, we're looking into if he was wearing his seatbelt or not. Speeding? Speed might be a factor, but that's still under investigation. Police are not releasing the names, but say the 15-year-old is from New Haven. They are looking at the video closely to determine what the driver of the Volkswagen was doing just seconds before the crash. Jonas says Dixwell Avenue is a very busy road. Cars speed all the time, and there are plenty of accidents. This is not the first time that, you know, I've seen accidents before. Uh, but the thing is, especially at the Duncan Dorrance area, I get customers every day that, you know, they say, oh, I almost got hit. And while this video that this local business was able to capture, it is helpful and it will help police. They're also looking for witnesses and they're encouraging anyone to come forward. Hampton police have asked us not to release the name of the 15-year-old. They're not releasing it at this time because they are still, what they say, notifying all their family. We're live with the Mobile Newsman Hamden, Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.